Jay has had a real roller coaster ride through his treatment. It hasn't been the textbook treatment for his leukemia. It's three and a half years of treatment, and it's a lot of treatment. And so he's in and out of the hospital. By the time he recovers from the chemo, it's time to get more chemo. He's put on a study. He was on life support for five days, um, intubated for three of those days, so he's, he had a machine breathing for him. Right now, he, Jay can travel about an hour from his hospital, and so we're kind of limited to the greater Orlando area. We love camping. I mean, Jay lives at a camp, and he loves, like I said, he loves the outdoors. So he found out that another kid received a camper, and he was like, that's what I want my Make-A-Wish to be. When Jay got the camper, it just gave him the chance to be a kid again, because when he was diagnosed, he was pulled out of school, he lost contact with a lot of his friends, he couldn't play soccer, he couldn't do those things that he had kind of grown up doing anymore. When he first saw the camper, he didn't want to come out of it. When we brought it home, he had to show everybody that was around. We slept in it the first night because he had to stay in it. The joy on his face, it's priceless. Hi, my name is Jay, and I'm going to give you a tour of my awesome camper. This is my awesome room where I sleep. It has really good storage. This is my comfy couch area. I wanted the microwave so I could have chicken nuggets and mac and cheese. And then I wanted an oven so we could bake cookies. So this is our diving area. Every night we play a board game. I have a TV, but it's really cool because it's Apple TV. Now I'll show you my bathroom and shower area. This is the shower and tub, and then I have this awesome shower curtain. What I think is really cool, the toilet flushes with a pedal. This switch gives us water. This one puts out the awning. It goes out like that, right there. Right here on the side, we have an outdoor shower. Like if you don't want to go in the camper muddy, you can rinse your feet off. One of my favorite parts of the camper is the Make-A-Wish logo, it, cause they um, granted my wish for the greatest camper ever. When it was revealed, it, it had every last little thing that, that he asked for. On the day that it was revealed, he got very emotional. He doesn't do that very often, and so it's really only with very significant stuff that that happens. And so just knowing how much it meant to him was just amazing because it was one of the first times that he really got that chance to just have something that was just his. Literally, Make-A-Wish came in at the right time because he was getting real down and it just gave him a huge boost. I immediately had tears in my eyes. To know that that is done for him, just just give a whole new outlook on, on life and, and what this organization does. This was, this was amazing. We've gone camping, set everything up, left for chemo, come back, continued camping because he has the environment now. We can keep it clean. He can have the food that he's allowed to have. As long as we're close to his hospital, we can be anywhere. And so now it makes some of those doctor's visits, something to look forward to, because as soon as he's done, he's gonna be right back camping and doing what he loves. Our future plans with the camper is we wanna go out west. He loves the beach, so we're definitely gonna spend more time at the beach and, uh, and just, you know, live life. The pure joy that comes to the children and their families. I know how I felt, and it wasn't even my wish. It, it was just amazing, and, and if it, if you have an opportunity to, to donate or to, to help out with Make-A-Wish, that is my, that's my number one.